Hello, everybody. Welcome to uh, week three, months, I guess, five and six of Raw is Emmy. Um, the, sh the show that accidentally predicts real life events. <laughs> <laughs> um, I am, as always, your favorite host, Emmy. Uh, I'm joined by your favorite hosts, Melly and Sasha. Hello. <laughs> Hi. And this time we've got a special guest. Hi there. Hi, Keith. <laughs> Keith. Hi. <laughs> you may remember one. him from such classics as XCOM. And being in the background during WWE 2K20. <laughs> I still remember the laughter when uh, the camera zoomed all the way outside the arena. <laughs> God, that game. <laughs> all right, that was a legendary uh, piece of work there. Also, hi. Using Hello, the everybody. Work with 2K20 is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> So, Keith, let me take you through our roster really quick. Oh, boy. <laughs> Night, Mom. Uh, are you watching on the stream, Keith? Uh, I certainly can if someone can help me. Oh, yes. Uh, whoops. Keith, also known as your grandfather trying to learn how to use the latest in social media. <laughs> Special guest, my grandpa. What? <laughs> <laughs> you know how like they have like uh, all, like you know the eighty-year-old let's players for like stuff like Oblivion. There should just be like an eighty-year-old uh, Fire Pro promoter player, <laughs> which is probably gonna be where I end up. Uh, <laughs> <so>. <laughs> All right, Keith, I sent you the link. I see that. And I just full-screened it, and I'm loving the first person. <laughs> <laughs> Dino Megazord in your face! Great Beast God, raw! <laughs> Sus, do you have the records up? Um, I can pull them up now. Mm. Uh, we've so also my... got Kurt Hawkins. Who is not on an infinite losing streak. <laughs> a case of laryngitis, according to his neck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everybody's got Hawkins. bad necks. <laughs> I like the idea that they just have, like, really sore throats now. <laughs> I'm Kurt Hawkins. Uh, we got Shark Boy. We got... Ta Shark Boy. We got Takamichi Noku. Got my favorite wrestler, Kotaro Suzuki. Oh, yeah. Who uh, also kind of has laryngitis. <laughs> so far, Dino Megazord is the only one who doesn't, and that's because he's a robot. I assume. <laughs> you know, he's his... Funaki Sorry. has a stomach ache. <laughs> oh. He's just hungover. <laughs> oh, the hurricane's fine. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Jimmy is Wang Yang is fine. <laughs> well, hell yeah, Jimmy Wang Yang is fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's Akio time, after all. Akio time. <laughs> it's always Akio time. Luna Vashon has a sore throat. <laughs> Every oh, hour yeah. of Rusev day is Akio time. <laughs> <laughs> I, Luna, Luna having a sore throat is no surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Command Bolshoi is fine. Nakano's fine. Miss Whalen Mercy, he's fine. <laughs> My neck's slightly banged up, but I'm okay. <laughs> We're 66 years old, that's fantastic. <laughs> yes, we yeah. we do read the chat. <laughs> yeah, yeah I've, se I've seen this dude nowadays. Uh, he is scary looking. <laughs> <laughs> he's that's just nice. like... <laughs> He just looks like the word muscle. It's like... <laughs> <laughs> uh, Fuka Kakimoto's fine. 
Oh god. Oh, ah, ah. oh right. Right. <laughs> that was not a great way to kick off Prime Month. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Mortis is not fine. Mortis <laughs> has seen better days. Saeed is fine. <laughs> well, <laughs> she's still hospitalized, but she's doing alright. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we had like the first episode. This lady has been in a hospital bed ever since the first episode. <laughs> yeah. Like, basically, my team is like three people that aren't great and one that's an absolute monster. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> Alex Shelley's fine. His condition's normal. He's fine. Kevin Nash is fine. Surprisingly. <laughs> His legs are still surprisingly fine. <laughs> Chris Sabin's fine. He's good. Chris Sabin's feeling great. <laughs> Hail Sabin. God. La Hedra has a sore throat. Feels like Mortis. mostly the, like, counterattack all went out drinking. And like, all just got fucked up. <laughs> La Hedra's just not doing great. Yeah. I think we're gonna have to hire like a bunch of guests for this month. <laughs> <laughs> Verona Morgan's doing fine. Yeah. So, um, did the buffs actually take effect for uh, the saver? Uh, it would just mostly be insane in like their base stats. Uh, oh, see. thanks, Akari. MK. Yeah, thanks. Uh, Two yeah, thanks. Uh, yeah, thanks. Vote uh, both uh, for the subs. Hey, appreciate that. Uh, similarly to uh, to um, hold on. Similar to. Uh, Keith, I have, uh, I'm a complete grandma when it comes to Twitch, so I have <laughs> little idea how this stuff works, uh, but <laughs> thank you very much. Because uh, there was, like, a countdown to thank you, people. And I was like, wait, what, why Why is it, like, a quick time event? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Dino Megazord. Greetings from Angel Grove. He even got, uh... <laughs> uh, okay, so... I would really prefer to not have to hire a bunch of guests. Like, I know we have nine million dollars, but, like... They all cost way too much money. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh... I guess you could always invite, but the problem is those are not guaranteed as we've, uh found out <laughs> yeah. pretty often. OTP, uh, right? <laughs> we, I like how he's from the WWE now. <laughs> oh! Oh, it's it's ODB as in Old Dirty Bastard. Not oh. the... Not the lady from, like, TNA. Okay. <laughs> that is oh, yeah. That would be one of the greatest bait-and-switches of all time. And he is, in fact, a Wu-Tang Clan member. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even notice that was his nickname. This is a very plain, like, he is a Wu-Tang guy. So we're running King's Road, by the way, Keith. We're trying to find King's Road wrestlers. He's always the laughing loony. They're always here. Didn't we try <laughs> last month, though? We tried hiring her, oh. but we didn't, like, call her in as a guest. Yeah, we could try to invite her instead. This broom. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> broom. <laughs> Go to me. Sadly, uh, sadly not compatible, but... <laughs> It'll gain it. I like how you have uh, Marker Crow Cop, and then you have Berka Crow Cop in the same <laughs> uh, section. Could get Daryl Quato. What? Why is he King's Road? 
Because <laughs> we said so. He's a student of Misawa. <laughs> uh, I'm so sad uh, that for P2 is not compatible. Oh yeah, Hinare is also King's Road. We could get Hinare if we wanted to. We could get Hinare. Uh, Tozawa. Nakanishi and Makabe. Makabe gave uh, me candy during the story mode. <laughs> Amiyo Abe looks uh, really cool though. Except all of her moves seem to be taunts. <laughs> yeah, this uh, isn't this like a manager or something? It's yeah. supposed to be, yeah. <laughs> what I love is the juxtaposition of a sexy pose to a prey for Buddha. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know. I mean, same. <laughs> <laughs> Guess you can always be both. To get you a girl who can do both. <laughs> Hell, now with the move craft, we can make uh, sexy Buddha pose. <laughs> <laughs> sexy prayer. <laughs> yeah. God. Uh, Ricochet's King's Road. With his fucking All Might outfit. <laughs> I can't get over Dio Madden. <laughs> AJ Lee, IRS. Old Bray Wyatt is also King's Road. He's got S <laughs> popularity. Hmm. You know, we just have retro Bray Wyatt. <laughs> Finally, the recognition. There's also, uh,. Undertaker, noted fan of ABBA. <laughs> <laughs> Bad ass. Either that, that, either that or that's his main and guilty gear. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, sadly can't get to the is King's Road. <laughs> He's <laughs> default, which means that he would be pretty good. <laughs> 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 The, the, the uh, John Smith template is actually uh, pretty formidable, as it turns <laughs> out. Meaning that if we got strong, man. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's when you have to find strong sad and strong mad and just start a stable. <laughs> <laughs> we actually did have a whole uh, strong bad team uh, last year. So, should we go for Bray Wyatt or Hinare? Let's go for Bray Wyatt, I think. Right. Eater uh, of streams. I like the well, idea of like older. Ah. Damn it. I can't, I can't uh, agree to the terms because uh, I'm in the past. That last Japanese name on the list is King's Road. Oh yeah, Ultra 7 is King's Road. He's also <laughs> expensive. That's true. Yeah, but like I think we can afford him at this point, maybe. Yeah, let's invite Ultra 7. Yeah. And Bray Wyatt. Yeah. And Death Yama-san, or...? Yeah. Okay. Oh, no, no. We do have to at least try to get the title match off that we've been kind of holding back on. Oh, the tag titles? Yeah. And is this one... Like... Which Kevin Nash tag... Because he had two. This would be Piranha Morgan and Kevin Nash, the old Sea Dogs. Okay. Let's invite... Uh, Death Yamasan, who's hanging out in Europe for some reason. Oh, she's spending a thousand bucks to Europe. Death takes a holiday. <laughs> All right, cool. Uh, Death of a salesman, but it just has to be every character. Ultra Seven costs eighty nine thousand dollars. <laughs> I hope they're fans of our product. And finally, Bray Wyatt. 13,000. 
Well, I guess Subaraya does need money. There's Death Yamasan, Ultra 7, and Bray Wyatt? Yep. Okay. That, you know, I, I I would normally say that would be my favorite King of Fighters team, but now that All-Star event has ruined that joke for me because they just made it real. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, do the main event title match. Mm-hmm. Um, Rod Morgan. Ugh. I can do that. I will do that. Uh... Kevin Nash. Wolfpack. And it was Just kinda... Taka and Funaki, right? Yeah. I'm no, sure Funaki doesn't get so injured. Make sure Funaki is coming up first so we get the theme, maybe. Oh, right. I didn't say that Ultraman will be in a KOF All-Star, but at that straight, why not? <laughs> <laughs> It'd probably be like manga Ultraman more than anything. But I want Chang to fight Pigmon. <laughs> <laughs> they probably hang out together. Tag team title match. I already know what match I want. I want. Uh, oh. Just kind of uh, writing the writing who's participating down. Versus. Wait, the Hydra shouldn't have a title. What? Oh, KFG kind of pointing out the like. Why he had her look like she had a title for a second? Might have been a goof. Oh, it yeah. was because of the, um... The, uh... Overlay getting loaded before the character model. Oh, uh, I see. So she she just, like, stole it from Saban for, like, two seconds. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a good outfit. Bray Wyatt versus Fuka. Wait, so we're gonna kill Bray Wyatt? <laughs> I hope he's a fan of our product. <laughs> I don't know what that outfit actually reminds me of, but it's something. He's <laughs> so got the Megazord and Ultra 7. Should fight. How's Hurricane doing? Hurricane is great. I think he should fight Hurricane Helms and uh, and his sidekick, the Flying Elvis. That's a good point. <laughs> this is a Keith, this is a Keith friendly match. You're telling me, good grief. <laughs> that one. Yeah. Are you going to open the show with that? Should I make it later on? Yeah, just because we do have Ultra 7 in there. And they may get a bit pissy if, like, you know, being, like, big, huge talent, they're put in the, in the opening match. Okay. Yeah, Ultra that, uh... 7 is such a prima donna. <laughs> well, I don't think Ultra 7 is, but Super Raya might be. That's a good point. Uh, gotta put Death Yamasan in here. I'm also keeping track of like guest uh, win loss records on the side, just in case. Uh, how's Kurt Hawkins doing? Fine. Ah, oh, he's neck though. Yeah, builds character. I think we should put some more people from uh, from Mel Squad on the show because we don't have a lot. How about Command Bolshoi? Versus Dead Yamasan? Yeah. That what would be a great match. Fucking cl <laughs> cl clown fight. <laughs> One is a metal clown, the other is, uh... A, a buff of... clown. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I 
put Luna and Bull in another match. They're pretty solid as a tag team. <laughs> um, they can go against... Motor City Machine Guns. Alright. The Motor City <laughs> Machine Guns in their get-along shirt. <laughs> Alex Shelley yeah, trying to make up for... Trying to make up with Chris Saban for the fact that Chris Chuck E. Cheese is declaring bankruptcy. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Yeah, I forgot how timely that was. Huh? In between episodes, Chuck E. Cheese filed the bankruptcy. <laughs> what a wild thing! Uh, let's see, uh, just opening at the match. Bad, you know, Robo going and thinking, "Wow, Robotnik really went too far here." <laughs> um, Shark Boy, we got. Oh, Waylon Mercy. We should put Waylon Mercy in the opener. Yeah. He is yeah. allowed to wear a shirt, right? No, he is not allowed to wear a shirt. Okay. It is Shark Boy that is allowed to wear a shirt. Yeah, that was a gimmick <laughs> match we had, Keith. Perfect. <laughs> Uh, so the fact that Waylon can... Mercy is coming in to fight a shark, just that sounds like something that would happen in a place called Cape Fear. <laughs> yeah, Mortis is like dying. Yeah, give Mortis the week off. Uh, yeah, definitely. Probably Katara Suzuki, so we don't have that match again. Fair. I think Katara, I think Katara Suzuki should be fine. He's a professional. <laughs> He's a professional Gundam fan. Uh, don't forget to check the the speed. Yep. Let's see. So, 800. It's a Zenima. Uh, I definitely want to watch the Fuka match. Yep. Already. Yep. And Tell match. Yep. Looks all good. Okay, cool. Uh, America Rural. What about America? Oh, no, not, not Japan. <laughs> We could get a hundred fans in Japan. I'd say it's let's bear nothing. <laughs> I'd say maybe let's play it safe and just do like urban small hall. That's $10. actually not bad. Forty nine hundred mm. for twenty bucks. I just consistently worried about the guests like leaving too. Mm. So I say we should just yeah. play it safe with a full house. Okay. Maybe do a little bit more advertising too. For fifteen thousand more dollars. Yeah. Okay. We yeah, already spent gonna... eighty-nine thousand on Ultra Seven. <laughs> Who's uh, the rough gonna be? That's. Uh, I think it's leave it just as a go for now. Uh, just make All double right. check and make sure the title matches up. Okay. Yep. So all good. All good. Yeah. Cool. Man, what's, what's funny is that recently I was trying to work on a Megum project again, and then this game was like, hey, move craft. And I'm like, damn it. <laughs> 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 oh, how are we doing there? Like, doctor stuff in the side, by the way. Oh, the training center? Yeah. I hope they're a fan of our products. Seriously, we've got a shit ton of t shirts to move. <laughs> <laughs> we, we're pretty yeah, okay it's... here. <laughs> okay. Should probably repair just, them all first. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm just remember I'm just uh imagining Dino Megazord with one of those like shirt cannons. <laughs> just like <Thump. laughs> yeah. comes out about Mach 4 and just rips through the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> well we lost some fans because you killed them with the shirt. <laughs> Do they still count as full house? <laughs> I just, I just remember that's that's sort of kind of how Flanders' wife died. I think it is actually. That that is. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh god. Wow, well, I can't Sorry, believe Ned. we're already stealing from the Simpsons. <laughs> Sorry, Ned Flanders. <laughs> All right, let us proceed. <laughs> Uh, Sweats. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Okay, cool, cool. Because uh, I, I think those show up 
before yeah. the screen. Yeah. Yeah, everybody came. Thank God. <laughs> All right, we had like back. a buffet out and... <laughs> I think we get entrances. Yes, we do. Not that everybody has. Not that anybody really has any themes. <laughs> Wake up and smell the coffee again. It's Bela Mercy. <laughs> I make really good coffee. If you want to come over to my house and try it. <laughs> <laughs> I got my beans from Colombia. You know what I mean? <laughs> now I use spring water from the ocean over there. Wait, that's not spring water, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> he gets loaded up on caffeine and just makes the fucking sleeper hold face. <laughs> I, I, I can't get over like the idea of somebody using salt water for coffee now. <laughs> like, oh yeah, by horrible. the way, here you go, Keith. <laughs> hey Adam, uh, <laughs> do you think Wayland of Mercy washes himself with a rap on his <laughs> Probably. <laughs> oh, rap's dead. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Ogawa. <laughs> I did that saltwater taffy, uh, fairly recently, so saltwater's been on my mind, but... We actually are using the Bellingham music, it's just very quiet in the background. <laughs> <laughs> nah, don't worry, I actually can't hear any of this. So. And Katara Suzuki wins. Damn, Waylon, uh. Just really falling down in the ranks here. <laughs> Further, he is now 0 and 4. Mel Squadra's having some problems. Fuga's carrying it all on her back. <laughs> With a little bit of help from Command Bolshoi. 100%! <laughs> nice! <laughs> 100% of a match. Well, Cinder, he's not a jobber if he just worked a 100% match. <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> I'm still trying to remember which IPW guy was in, uh... WWF in like the mid 80s for like one match where like, he just got the shit kicked out of him by Bad News uh, Brown, I think. Was it Tony the Spider, I think? No, no, it was Keith Watkins. Uh, oh. It was not Spider the Tony. Nah, oh, sadly. <laughs> that sounds like an Ace Attorney name. <laughs> There's somebody who gives like Zeppelin rides. <laughs> Ace Attorney did have a couple of wrestlers in it in uh, one of the games. I'm surprised nobody did anything with that. <laughs> so one of them looked uh, looked strikingly like King from Tekken, except he was like a nine fox ta uh, nine tailed fox, <laughs> not a nine <laughs> fox tail. <laughs> I forgot about that case. Yeah, that's a best. Yeah, that uh, case is really weird, but I kind of dug it. <laughs> the case where the greatest piece of evidence you could possibly have was kayfabe real. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because the one guy was like in character and he's just like, Oh yeah, sorry, that, that's just kind of what I do. <laughs> I believe for this biz, man. <laughs> Bad news <laughs> versus Rowan Spider. <laughs> <laughs> Rowan Spider just sounds like a Lucha name. <laughs> I realize with with regards to Park Scott, you could probably just make like Rowan Spider a wrestler now. Oh god. <laughs> what I noticed with Movescraft is that you can make a move where like their head can just turn into a chair. <laughs> <laughs> Because, like, there's, like, that, that uh, section on the right that's, like, the, you know, the hands and stuff, uh, you know, position here, and here's the sprites for it. You can just, like, turn the head into, like, a hand and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I hope no someone replicates no the move I saw on, um, 
Twitter, which was the fucking person turns into a chair and appears behind them. Yeah, they made the chair's illusion like a ninja technique. <laughs> it's <was> so good. <laughs> They're cursing all over the guy, uh, I think Minoru Suzuki soccer kicked that guy's head off, and then he just <laughs> casually put it back on. <laughs> I think specifically New Legacy made that one. Yeah. I can tell because that's, that's the one that went around the most. <laughs> but, uh, I mean... I mean, I tried to make Scorpion's win pose from Mortal Kombat 3 for some reason? Uh, it came out okay, but I think my greatest work is doing the neck cut and growl, except, uh, after they do the ne neck cut, they just stand there for a minute and their head just falls off. Alright. The machine guns win. <laughs> Damn. Oh, also, loss for... uh, have a good one, Akari. Thanks for stopping by. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I was uh, very distracted there. <laughs> I saw a move Another where someone throws... Nice. Where someone move, throws the fork across the ring to stab someone. <laughs> I was thinking of doing something with that. Uh, I don't know why, but it just reminds me of that, like... That, uh... Mostly pretty bad Daredevil movie with, uh... Colin Farrell as Bullseye. But I just kinda <laughs> wanna give him that. <laughs> I think... I missed! I never missed. <laughs> <laughs> I think Alex Shelley's gonna take Chris Saban to the one surviving Discovery Zone in America. <laughs> to celebrate them becoming number one contenders. Yeah. <laughs> Hail Shelley. Disclaimer, I don't actually know if there's any surviving Discovery Zones in America. I think they're all gone. <laughs> The last one I ever heard about was like eight years ago, and I'm pretty sure it's gone by this point. One of the best DLC characters. <laughs> I think I still have like. Oh, wait, hang on. Yeah, right. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> I think I still have like an arcade token around somewhere, but I don't know where arcade is for. I have a Japanese arcade token. And my dream yeah. in life, my goal, is to just find what arcade it's from. <laughs> well, my, one, uh, one uh, thing on the list for me to... list of things for me to do sometime in my life is to show up on uh, one of those Mikado tournaments they upload at YouTube, playing like... I don't know, like Kabuki Clash or some shit. <laughs> uh, Adam, no, this is not that that the Amazon that won't shut up. I am, I am not going to subject the audience to that. <laughs> I live in fear of what I've created. <laughs> I don't know if we can subject uh, the audience to Easy Pete Clone. Is he here? <laughs> yes, he is. You. First. <laughs> <laughs> I, guess that was for a second. <laughs> yeah. I think that was foreshadowing for the fact that one of the main characters of the Vanishing's catchphrase is just YOU BASTARD! <laughs> Trust oh, me, we've no. done that with like... I've subjected Emmy to that many times. Along with our <laughs> Jay White that won't shut up. <laughs> Cutthroat ERROR! <laughs> <laughs> uh, only 83. Uh, come in. Come in, Boshe now brings herself up to a nice two and two. Alright, she's doing okay. Alright, can Ultra 7 make up for Death Yamasan on, like, team guests? Also, it's <laughs> been really good for Player 2 this, uh, this go round. <laughs> Why is it always like this? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Death to the death. In that seven, uh, guide, seven, to, seven. <laughs> in that guide to Tom Hanks video, uh, where 
he, he turned the movie uh, that thing you do into you that thing do. Uh, the tagline was something like "Death is the truth. Death is pure death. Death or something." <laughs> <laughs> Just something weirdly, really, weirdly morbid. We were actually at Full Moon, and they had just a whole, like, end cap with a bunch of Tom Hanks movies, and all I could think of was the guide to Tom Hanks. <laughs> <laughs> Which ones did you see from uh... I couldn't remember some of the names, but, like, Sully was there. Sully. 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 Jimmy uh, Wait, isn't Jimmy Helms a No More Heroes character? No, that's Matt Helms. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is the new No More No More Heroes character. No more hurricane. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> <laughs> What's really weird about No More Heroes is it's literally just Suda 51 making a tag team of assassins. It's like, okay, so one of them is Genichi, uh, Genichiro Tenryu, <laughs> and the other is Johnny Knoxville. <laughs> Duff, Duff Yamasan. Yamasan. <laughs> oh my god, if you get if they added parts for like you know, custom objects like a beer can or something. It's just the custom weapons are just the one thing you can't do with the parts craft. Yeah. You know that you just make their hands like beer cans or something. I mean, that's doable. Yeah. A five-second film made, uh... I don't know why I was reminded, instead of Edward Scissor hands, it was just Edward 40 hands. <laughs> he just had, like, two bottles of 40 as hands. <laughs> oh, did they? <laughs> <laughs> wow, these, huh. these both sound great. They did the... the Billy Gun No Mercy. <laughs> Uh, if only you could put the mosaic. <laughs> that was Akio time there for a second. <laughs> Akio time went a lot faster. How fast can you move in the Akio time? <laughs> Too fast. Too fast. <laughs> yeah, I, I saw that. Did they, did they actually manage to make the mist effect? Because that was like the one thing I couldn't figure out. I thought that was just like hard coded or something. What did Hurricane just do there? He like went up, went down, went up, went down, went up, went down. A lot of fire like... characters do that for some reason. I think there's like at least three people on the in one of the melt bashes where they just did like four. Uh, Elbow drops. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, I'm... there's the casual <sighs> vertebrae breaker there. <laughs> yeah, because I'm trying to figure out how they do like the fire, because I kind of want to do like a toasty <laughs> move, but I can't. Uh... <laughs> can't figure out how to do that. It's Akio time. <laughs> And Hurricane's oh, like, we shot. have them, the speed force. <laughs> uh, 41 minute lost, match! Uh, oh my god. 100%. <laughs> oh man. Again, two player. Uh, yeah, right! <laughs> like, <laughs> Sweats. <laughs> <laughs> Do I the book in here? <laughs> oh boy, here's the match. <laughs> Wake up and smell the coffee. <laughs> Wake up and smell the coffee, Cena. <laughs> Let me into your house and drink your coffee, Cena. I'll make you drink it with that sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yep, but, she uh, fight Fuka. <laughs> Who, uh... Oh, uh, okay, it's like... Is she wearing shoes, or are they supposed to just be, like, foot guards? 
It's barefoot foot guards, like uh, what Oscar used okay. to wear. Okay, because hardcore back there. Because I was, uh, I was afraid this would be another one of those edits where they just forgot to put soles in the shoes. <laughs> Some reason I remember the Tommy Wiseau edit I have not having that. That felt like weirdly on brand. <laughs> you know you're not wrong. <laughs> Nobody's I looking at your feet, huh? <laughs> I was thinking, what's the use of even wearing them? <laughs> not to mention, it gets me in good with Quentin Tarantino, right? God, that probably would be it. <laughs> that probably would be his attempt to get in one of those movies. This movie won't sell unless you will show my ass and toes. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Five star classic Quentin Tarantino presents. <laughs> I'm honestly surprised he hasn't been in a Tarantino movie yet, to be honest. <laughs> Yep, so, so is far, Fuka uh, like 4 and 0 right now? Uh, Fuka is only 3 and 0. Oh. She, must, she might have missed a week. So she took a week off. Or a month <laughs> yeah, cause, off, I guess. <laughs> yeah, because she, you know, <laughs> knocked uh, one of the characters oh, uh, into the next one. Oh, Jesus! Oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> 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 She had to pull Phoenix Punch there! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, I'll have to clip that later. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, the Zangief spinning pile driver is definitely an obligatory one, too. I actually tried doing uh, one of Shadow Dio's moves from the Capcom fighting game, then, uh... I realized that there might be a bug in the move craft uh, thing. What's I wonder the bug? if it would be feasibly possible to do like uh, fucking Mike Haggard's like jumping pile driver. <laughs> oh yeah. Remember the Heihachi jumping out power block? Dude, that'd be great. I'm just thinking of the Tekken 2 version where he's like, DO IT! <laughs> Duck. She's about to do it! Oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> uh, but, yeah, when I was trying to uh, make the Shadow Dia move, I realized that the uh, preview and the uh, play test aren't, like, synchronized the same. Huh. So, like, it's weirdly tedious for no real reason. <laughs> the, 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 like, ringside check or whatever it is, is always a big pain and it's not worth it because it's like the AI is also fighting you. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. So what I had to do to test out my move is I basically just had to do, like, one player versus two player, where I had both of the controllers. And even then that's tough because they just auto-counter sometimes. Yeah, that's kind of the weird thing of how this game works. <laughs> it's like when the game knows that you shouldn't be able to pull off that move, it will not let you, no matter what. Mm -hmm. It's just like... Ah, just at least have like a training dummy or something. I'm really uh, yeah. curious if she does that punch, can it potentially send him out of the ring? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing a battle royal and you just lose because your ass gets punched over the top rope from halfway in the goddamn <laughs> That would be one of the highest selling <laughs> match tapes ever. You you can't make the Hadoken. That's you can, you can do the thing. animation, but you can't do the flame. Yeah. If, uh, you might be able to do, like, that, like, fiery Hadouken that's, like, was a thing for some reason. Wow, okay, uh. <laughs> Zero and three on guests. <laughs> Jesus. And I think Four that's and oh for Fuka. That is another player to win, yeah. <laughs> 88%, uh... 
the lowest they were rated really... match on the card. Four and zero. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and now the title match. This is uh, making her uh, losing a fight to a person in cat costume. <laughs> Why does it think Fuka is a swear? Well, I mean, I know why, but, like, that's silly. <laughs> yeah. Fuka currently redacted from Push. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin Morgan? That feels Kevin. like an actual wrestler. <laughs> Let's see, Kevin Morgan. That, yeah, uh, there's the theme. That, that is a baseball player. <laughs> uh, he is a former Major League Baseball player and the current New York Mets executive. <laughs> Good. Meaning that uh, both of them will have to end up on a baseball team in Super Mega Baseball eventually. Alright, it's Tornado. <laughs> God, those new DLC heads, like, when I see somebody I actually recognize represented in those, it's so off-putting. Because <laughs> that does just look like yeah. realistic Taka, but, like, this art style is not realistic, <laughs> so it's like... <laughs> it's not nearly as bad as, like, pasting someone's face on a car, though, in, like, 2K, in the 2K games. <laughs> <laughs> Or they did for that uh, SNES fighting game based off of the uh, Japanese uh, impressionist comedian, where they just got like. It actually reminds me a lot of, of uh, Game Boy Camera in hindsight. A little bit. Yeah, because it's like photos of real people, but the bodies are all drawn. And uh, it just makes it scary looking. <laughs> ooh, ooh. <laughs> Stop that! <laughs> so they are right. Fuga does deserve a title shot, but the only issue is, what do we do next week? Should we have uh, Saban versus Fuka, or should we have another tag title match? I suppose let's see how everybody's condition is at the end of the night. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because uh, Brain might have died. <laughs> <laughs> well, Bray is also a guest. Oh, so yeah, who yeah, gives that's... a shit? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that bro, I forgot about that. Uh, but I'm more just concerned of, like, if uh, Kai and Tai retain again. Uh, you know, Funaki's probably going to be in, like, incredibly bad condition. <laughs> well, now he's bleeding. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of speaking of moves, it reminds me that uh, there was a move in No Mercy where they just repeatedly slammed their head into the mat over and over again. And it's funny how it took this series until almost the end of this game's uh, update lifespan to finally get that move. <laughs> it had to take them years to even get like a full Nelson hold, which is very strange to me. It took them a long time to get the three amigos. Like I was always just checking for that. <laughs> and it was they, weird because uh... they had the Eddie Guerrero head and like you can't make an Eddie Guerrero without that. Yeah. Well now we <laughs> can have it. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Uh, I'm trying to figure what else. Damn, I totally forgot. <laughs> anyway. Ah, Funaki won't die. This isn't Wrestling Evolution. <laughs> oh no. I might have to make Bob Why Not in this. <laughs> Problem is, like, you know, the uh, mod that I always use is, like, oh. not really. <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> Jesus. 
That's another clip right there. Uh, yeah, it's like in the works of being uh, updated to the current version, meaning that uh, yeah, the test. Jeez. Funaki covered in blood. <laughs> oh man, I I want to remake Kevin Nash's like slow ass taunt from uh, Fan sixty four game. <laughs> New chance, 65%. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> they did not like that. For some I reason. I think it was, that was probably just a way to get Funaki, like, a chance to rest. Yeah. We had to take the title <laughs> off of him. <laughs> 100, 183, 188, 65. <laughs> Crab got a little tired after the 45 minute match in the middle there. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. Luna Vachon's injured. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> Pictures. Yay! <laughs> so many injuries going on. 800 people standing room only. <laughs> They were showing it, like, in one of those, uh, drive-in theaters. <laughs> <laughs> and man, how'd they fit all that people there when they had to keep them six feet apart? <laughs> Sonata and Kushida. Oh no. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that is some fuck money right there. <laughs> Shh. I believe, um... On, like... Streamlabs, if somebody donates, uh, it should still have Virgil popping up going, FUCK MONEY! <laughs> <laughs> well, probably not right now, because we don't have Streamlabs or anything open. Yeah, yeah. Rosemary, my favorite spice. <laughs> uh, solid snake won something. <laughs> something Kuga. of Sega. You got a lot huh? of... Japanese names that we should probably fix. Crowbar. Hey, Jay, dark. <laughs> and the bloody. And crowbar. And crowbar. <laughs> I will have you know that I have my autographed photo of crowbar sitting right above my bed. Oh, really? <laughs> Snuggling right up to Vern Gagne. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if crowbar is a fan of the band crowbar. <laughs> And this game loves and respects Jayla Dark too, because she's six ta six person tag champion for a company now. <laughs> this month you have a single tournament scheduled with TV. <laughs> <laughs> Saida is free to is safe to work again. And blonde. <laughs> we have rebuilt. Shin up. bitch found Hiroya Matsumoto. <laughs> Why is there such a big space? <laughs> <laughs> they found a ghost. Found a ghost. <laughs> they also found a bunch of kids in a van with a Great Dane investigating it. <laughs> <laughs> they found these weird, like, Swedish metal guys with face paint on. Oh no! <laughs> Wins the title, leaves the company. <laughs> Typical. God, I love this picture so much. Your wrestlers through children. It would be so adorable if they didn't have those like creepy sunken <laughs> in eyes. <laughs> the or if, like the fucking dude on the left wasn't just Kenny Omega. About to do his finisher on a child. <laughs> I kid had it coming. Uh oh. <laughs> Hurricane Helms and Parada Morgan. Why? <laughs> do they have beef? I guess so, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Megazord and Waylon Mercy. <laughs> Hanging out with the kids. <laughs> Alright, uh, Hurricane Helms and Parada Morgan. 
Sure. I love that they always play these two messages. Like, is there supposed to be one where it's like a rivalry has started, but it hasn't boiled over yet? Like, <laughs> no, they 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 just made up. As I was saying, and it's fine now. <laughs> All good. Lots of notifications this month. Okay. So let's check human resources and see how everybody's doing. Oh no, um, records. Hey, right. Dynamite Swords <clears throat> in good condition. Uh, Kurt Hawkins is looking good again. Uh, Shark Boy's doing good. Talk, Talk is, is Talk is fine. Katara is okay. Funaki, Funaki needs gets the week fun. off. Uh, Hurricane <laughs> Helms has got a neck ache. Jimmy, oh boy, you get the week <laughs> off. Little Bashan is out on doctor's orders. Ben Bolshoi is doing fine. volcano has got a neck ache. Wayla Mercy's fine. Fuka's, as usual, fine. I feel like Where's this is... getting better. Yeah. I feel like this is just another case where it's like Alco again, but... <laughs> Saya is in good condition again. Saya is back, motherfuckers. <laughs> Straight out of the hospital. Fine, Nash is fine. Sabin's, Sabin's fine. Kidra's fine. So yeah, everybody's doing okay with some except, glaring exception. Except for Funaki, Jimmy, and Mortis. Yep. Uh, let's see. I guess human resources, let's send these guys back out on scouting again. Mr. Question, I'm watching you. <laughs> oh, we should check the new people that they found. Yes. Let's look into these ghosts. <laughs> Time to go on some ghost adventures. Uh, it was in, in Europe. Europe. Uh, <laughs> Wait, it might have been Ghostface Killer? Oh, <laughs> God, I hope so. Uh, let's just check he's, who oh, else. Oh, he's not King's Road, damn it! <laughs> yeah, I think it would have to be Ghostface Killer. Oh, you can check the red. Oh, wait, that is it, huh? Well, that was in Europe, yeah. Oh, uh, it was Japan <laughs> for the other Hiroya one. Hiroya Matsumoto. Uh... Monster Ripper? Hell yeah. Santa! Santa's in Japan! We oh, found him. Santa's gonna have to put a smack down on some children. <laughs> Villainous <laughs> Goldberg. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hint of Slay. Ah, yes, that movie. <laughs> My favorite Goldberg moment will forever be when he screamed, I eat chicken. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she's showman, so neither of these guys gave us fucking anything. Wait, I think I think she was in the first Melt Bash, actually. I have to go back and check that. I'd say let's try for hiring Bray Wyatt again. Okay. I'm <laughs> sad we can't use Jim Mobile Suit. <laughs> That's pretty good. Please, Mobile Suit was my father. Call me Jim. <laughs> <laughs> You're asking for Goldberg here. I'm I'm waiting for uh, Gilbert Goldbug. Yay! Goldbug. And I shall <laughs> move Bray Wyatt to the unaffiliated section. This is what this is what you do if someone doesn't sign. You put him in a match with Fuka as a guest. Then you ask him again. Are <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you gonna sign or what? <laughs> So, what do we want to do? Do we want to give Fuka a title match? Hmm. Well, yeah, I'd say... Make that the sub-main event, and then the main event would be Hurricane Helms versus Piranha Morgan. Okay. I'm sorry to cut... Uh, <laughs> sorry to cut in, but uh, I just saw a clip of another custom move somebody made where they did, like, a ground pound, and a chair came out of the mat and hit them in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Management. Merchandise.
merchandise. Nice. We can make more. Some towels and some goods. Yeah, but are they popular with housewives yet? <laughs> I still don't get that. <laughs> Do housewives just typically have a lot of wrestling themed towels? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna look at this move. Is it the same reasons why housewives buy a lot of common rider <laughs> merchandise of pretty young men? <laughs> oh, Maybe. I love Sorry. this move. I, I can hear it. <laughs> I can hear it, but I don't know what it is. Uh, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna go for it, Sasha. Alright. <laughs> oh, that's awesome! Wait, there's a... What? There's a second part. There's a second part? <laughs> just I'm just gonna punch the like in, the in chat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Hi, I'm gonna follow this person now. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyone? Do we want to try to invite anyone again? Um. Hmm. Or do you think we're fine? Let's see if we can't invite somebody from Sosh Down. See if they got any like Kings Road people hanging out in there. We got Asuka, who's hurt. Oh, they do. We got Luke Harper. Hmm. 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 Now, is he the guy with the messed up theme? Which, Might be. Which one? The one oh. where it was just like the first Super like loud. six seconds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was Luke Harper. <laughs> okay, because that's all I know about him. <laughs> so yeah, let's let's invite Luke Harper. <laughs> Darn it! <laughs> They almost, they almost took the bait. What's in the spaces in this? <laughs> you know, the bait. <laughs> uh, the quote-unquote bait. Uh, who else are we interested in signing? Ultra 7? He was also really expensive, so like... Yeah. Uh, Death Yamasan. Invite her again. Yeah. She only costs seventeen hundred. Okay, so I honestly think we're okay. Curious how close we are to a tournament. Eighty-seven percent. Almost there. So I think next week we might be able to run a tournament. Hmm. I guess this is another wrestling post, uh, related post, but, uh, the question is, have, have you ever seen Boz Rutten and Pitbull in the same room? <laughs> <laughs> X-Files theme. <laughs> you know, Boz Rutten famed a Kevin James collaborator. <laughs> Was that a Mo post? That feels like a Mo post. No, this is actually another uh, wrestling buddy of mine. Oh. But Mo would absolutely make that post. I mean, he just made a post about face at Boss Rutten, so... <laughs> oh. <laughs> How do you face at Boss Rutten? He's already always smiling anyway. <laughs> I love Boss Rutten. He's a nice guy. Yeah, he's not nice in Virtual Pro Wrestling too, but... <laughs> then again, he's a shoot fighter in that game, meaning he is a monster. <laughs> the thing is, a lot of a lot of people say the N64 games are great. None of them say they're balanced. <laughs> <laughs> they're okay. I'll give Chris Sabin his tiny pants. <laughs> These are like my Perry title belt pants. I think Perry Saturn was like banned tier and no mercy because he just had that sweep kick that was like it would just out prioritize everything. <laughs> hmm. I already know what we're doing for one of these. No wait, 
we were were we not we were not able to get Luke Harper, right? We were not, no. Damn it. That's what I think we should have Bray Wyatt fight Death Yamasan. <laughs> Alright. Sick. <laughs> damn, damn. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> we should just make like a match with Sai at the main event, just as a celebratory welcome back. <laughs> <laughs> I think if... she should at least be in a tag match. Yeah. Let's <laughs> uh, say Sai, Ida, and La Hiedra. They're both green. Just... Actually, yeah, three would work, because that's, like, darker green. Because she's more oh, well... serious. <laughs> Little giant. Ida and La. Uh... Let's see. Command Bolshoi is without a partner. Or no, Bol Nakama is without a partner. Command Bolshoi, Mortis. Hmm. I think... Command Bolshoi and Mortis. Uh, Mortis is still kind of uh, iffy, remember? Oh. I was going to say Bull Nakano and uh, Command Bolshoi. Uh, Counterattack needs some representation tonight. Oh, wait. Uh... How about Taka and Shark Boy? Nice. <laughs> Don't forget, Shark Boy needs his shirt. Yep. Yeah, Lava Girl sucks. Tacos where it's at. <laughs> so, uh, they tried to sue him, by the way. Like, Miramax tried to sue Sharkboy, the wrestler, <laughs> and he won. <laughs> yeah, because it's, it's Sharkboy. <laughs> it's, a, it's a very generic name. Um... <laughs> but it was also like, I've been using this name for, like, years. I think Bull I and Whale and Mercy, because Command. No, wait. Yeah, Whale Wh and Mercy versus uh, somebody. Actually, wait, no. Do do Whale and Mercy versus Bray Wyatt. Oh, yeah. Later down the card. <laughs> Sorry, Death Yamasan. Uh... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up? Controller fell. Oh. oh. Whoops. Okay, there we go. Uh, I was gonna say maybe Command Bolshoi and Bolnakano versus uh, versus the major the major wrestling figures. Yeah, that's true. Bolnakano. Dino Mangazord and Kurt Hawkins. Make it green. He's the Green Ranger. <laughs> uh, I feel like we should throw in another match here, because like you were talking well, about well, before, I don't want Death Yamasan to be first on the card. Hmm. I have Katara Suzuki in a match against... The problem is the only people we have left are... Oh, oh wait, we have Alex Schill and Kevin Nash. Yeah. Katara Suzuki versus Kevin Nash. <laughs> he, won a ti he won a title last week, so he gets to be young. <laughs> I'm sure that's how it works in Mortal Kombat or something. He's <laughs> old some youth. <laughs> Except Shang Tsung never wins because he's like useless. I don't forget to make Helms vs. Morgan like the main event. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay. And then Alex Shelley vs. Death Yamasan. Nice. Uh. That depends. Like, a junior title shot or a tag title shot? Because it doesn't really have a tag team partner. Yeah, because he's facing Kevin Nash, who's not exactly a junior heavyweight. <laughs> I 
I think it would be funny if Kevin Nash had to wrestle in the junior heavyweight division. He did in TNA. Yeah, that's a good point. He did. Also, just make sure all the... Uh... Oh, cool. We can get a full house on $20. Nice. Uh, let's... Oh, and I don't even need that. Cool. Uh, let's make sure all the, the match speeds are right. Yep. Yeah, we'll have to change those. Uh, 800, 800, 800, 800. Yes. So we get to watch three matches tonight. Hell if, yeah! If we would like to do that. Yeah. Okay. Alright, uh, just give me one second to write some of these folks down. Mm -hmm. uh, on the if Kataro Suzuki wins, he gets a title shot provided he can find a tag team partner. Jim Mobile Suit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why not? I mean, the funny thing is, like, if you do sign people with, uh, you know, different fighting styles, uh... Oh, wait, no, I think... Never mind, I'm getting confused. Because <laughs> I think it's like, if you put people at the very start, they'll all change to whatever style you dictated, I suppose. But, uh... I forget, like, if you sign other people on, like, with different styles, do they still, uh... Are so, they still a different style, or...? <laughs> yeah, so what you would do there is if you go to configure match style and rules, and then do match style... Yeah. Y ...you can change it, but both of those people should be the same style. Okay. Or else people might get mad and angry. <laughs> See? Okay, we're all good here. Okay, cool. Confirm. Yeah, cause I'm, 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 oh, I guess you can sign freestyle people. Yeah. Freestyle means uh. they're like MMA people. Ah, I see. I'm just trying to figure out a way to get an F for P2 in here, to be honest. <laughs> Alrighty, let us proceed. Good uh, on, good on, good on. You actually are 1 1. No, sadly, it means they're it means they're like um, shoot fighters. Yeah, an all around uh, style would be really good, but <laughs> if nothing else, if if Death Yamasan cancels, this will rectify it. Yeah. Yeah. And she didn't. Oh no! It happens after this, I believe. I thought it was before. Okay, good. And she showed up. Okay. Shark boy. Two and two. All good, Sash? Yep, we're just... We're just taking notes of things. Okay. Young Nash. <laughs> this would be a uh, mini Vegas. <laughs> We're going out of here, I suppose. Welcome, Oz. <laughs> he wrestled in New Japan as Oz, which uh, is amazing to me. <laughs> I was looking up uh, Scott Norton matches, and uh, yeah, there he, he, he was still Oz. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> That's a good play. Maybe Deathy Amazon will be like, okay, your federation's pretty good, I guess. <laughs> this is the fastest Kevin Ash has ever moved in his life. 
<laughs> that was that speeding vehicle in the background. It was just Kevin Nash. <laughs> it's a diesel truck. <laughs> I was like, what, 2.9 already? And I'm like, oh yeah, five minutes is like two seconds now. Yeah. I like that the chair just kind of popped out of nowhere. <laughs> There's been a lot of that going around. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Still trying to figure out, if you do a move onto a weapon, does it do more damage? I don't know. I don't think it does, because usually uh, one of the mods uh, I had revealed that uh, initially there was not even really an interaction going on with that. Dash wins again. Darcy yeah. has not had a good couple weeks. <laughs> yeah. I'm so excited he for the Steam that... mods. Sorry. He lost that title once and he just... He just hasn't gotten his mojo back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for the Steam mods to be like compatible now because the current test builds are like it works, and then you go into edit mode and the game crashes. <laughs> so, Oof. Yeah. We got Bull in the con we got Bull Joy. <laughs> that is name. not my joke, that was a uh, punk grip. <laughs> Bull Bull Joy. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. And the major wrestling figures. Man and his toy. <laughs> Take a sword, Kurt. <laughs> <laughs> That's an East West Bull name right there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> that might have to be the episode title now. Nice Kurt, like you, you look like you got belly. I don't know, maybe uh, maybe you got really shiny hungry. Right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, shiny belly. <laughs> I was trying to look at the shading, but then I forgot that our wrestlers are now moving at the speed of light. I can't really see it now. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, it's like his his waist is shinier than his upper half, I think. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm real excited about that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> The cops are playing the part of Rita Nice. <laughs> What's uh, Megazord's uh, record at this point? Uh, Megazord is currently 2-2. Two and two. Ah, I see. <laughs> He's uh, fist pumping an awful lot. <laughs> He's just charging the file bunker. <laughs> Does the Megazord have a pile bunker? A what? Does the Megazord have a pile bunker? I like to think maybe it does. Alright, the pendulum stretch. That reminds me, uh, we got a comment on the last one confirming it was a pendulum stretch. And the name looked familiar, and I'm pretty sure it's one of the voice actors from this game that posted on our video. Nice! <laughs> uh... uh I believe he does the voice for Japanese male too. Uh, so, Takashi Matsumoto, if you're watching, uh, thank you very much, and uh, hope you're enjoying it. And uh, I love your stream uh, voice clips. <laughs> <laughs>
Why are these two going for 30 minutes? <laughs> I love the match. <laughs> I love the matches. It's just like, I guess their teamwork set to zero. So, like, when they get in, they just don't tag out the entire time. <laughs> Oh my god, if this doesn't get 100% I'll be very confused. <laughs> it's like, also, oh, Megazord is there. We have gone for so long that the Benny Hill theme has gone to its second key. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the second match. match! Wrap him up! Uh, <laughs> oh, he's still more finisher! There's someone on the second, second match is just like, still in the bathroom, oh my god, they're in the <laughs> <laughs> Everybody else, finally, jeez. <laughs> Everybody in the locker room is just like <laughs> peeking out. It's like, oh, they're still going. Okay. <laughs> Almost <sighs> an hour later. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Also, so, unless point... anything major happens. Um... Oh, uh... <laughs> <laughs> We're back. Uh, oh, unless man. anything. Can, can, are we able to be seen right now? Okay. Yeah. Alright. Uh, unless anything major happens in the next tag match, I think Kurt Hawkins and the Dino Megazord should be number one contenders. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wait a minute, I thought Chris Saban and Alex Shelley were already number no, one no, contenders. Yeah, they're next on the list. Or, next month, month we could have it that they face the winners of the next tag team. Number one contendership. Number one contendership. Number one, contendership. Number one contendership. Move craft front. I forgot that uh, Ramona, aka Atlas Shrugged, uh, did make the finger poke of doom. Oh <laughs> god, yeah. <laughs> Watching the video, it's uh, it's pretty great. Because I thought it was gonna be like a big dramatic grapple, but that was just like a light attack that just sends them flying. <laughs> <laughs> Shark boy is coming, mother shucker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw that one sign that I saw a post about uh, in stores where it said, Attention, customers do not shuck the corn. <laughs> okay, YouTube better not go on for 60 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the the Seahawks. Seahawks. There we go. <laughs> That's her name. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I do appreciate the matches where most matches are ending conclusively. Yeah. <laughs> We're just wiping some sweat. E. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Got so weird to see her um, in the ring. What the fuck was that? That was Saida. <laughs> <laughs> 
Like, Sound <laughs> moves slower yeah. in the fast time. <laughs> e. Sasha, help me out. Give me a, give me a ocean related thing. Oh, there we go. Oh. Give me an ocean related thing that rhymes with Kai. Tide? Kai and Tide. Kai and Tide. Hell yeah. <laughs> 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 Beautiful. Ninety-seven. Not bad. You would have got a hundred if you win for twenty more minutes. Yeah, the Amazon <laughs> and Alex Shelley now. Oh boy. Welcome back, Saida. You you lost again. <laughs> Saida has been injured. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing loony. Mm. <laughs> yeah, the funny thing is there were those uh, PS1 rants. And Scott Steiner is like, then you'll know why they call me the superstar. I was like, what, what, they actually call him that generic ass name. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it turns out they did. I guess for like five seconds, but <laughs> just out of all the nicknames, the superstar. <laughs> <laughs> the superstar. <laughs> Yeah, I was about to say, it just like <laughs> sounds like a default creative character, but it's like fucking like Scott Steiner. <laughs> death. Really, really quick death. Death. Shot <laughs> face. Oh, I'm glad this is in 2K20, or else they would, like, all these matches would have ended in countouts. Yep. <laughs> or, uh, Wrestling Revolution, where, uh, <laughs> they were just going in and out, and in and out, and in and out. <laughs> wow. Sorry, Death Yamazon. Again. <laughs> Damn. Eighty one. All right, Bray Wyatt and Waylon Mercy. <laughs> yeah, Death Yamasan is. I think there's. I think like the Stardom people aren't like balanced well against people that aren't the other Stardom people. <laughs> really upset that Alex Shelley and like Chris Brooks have never been in the same picture together. X-Files <laughs> thing. <laughs> it's just bigger Luke. <laughs> it's Alex Shelley and bigger Alex Shelley. <laughs> Al Alex shelley -er. Keith, I'm gonna send you pictures to show you what I mean. <laughs> oh, <no>. uh... <laughs> that synced up perfectly on my end, that was weird. <laughs> Alex Shelley. Alex Shelley. <laughs> Alex! They, they should have. Um, I'm thinking about what uh, three fighters used to do when they made like hidden characters that were just extra outfits. So it would be like uh, 
Serfidia and Soul Edge would just be like, Serfidia. Then it'd be Serfidia with an exclamation point. <laughs> and Serfidia with two exclamation points. <laughs> so, apparently Serfidia in her bathware is referred to as Serfidia! <laughs> and then Diver is Serfidia? <laughs> oh yeah. The uh, non-playable Soul Blade characters is uh, one of my favorite things in gaming of all time. <laughs> Okay, Keith, I'm sending to you on Discord. Here's Alex Shelley. I've shown you him before. Yep. And this is British wrestler Chris Brooks. A very large picture. Whoops. Damn. It's like, the only difference is that Alex Shelley is like 5'10", and Chris Brooks is like... Six foot eight. He is very tall. <laughs> Alex Shellius. Yeah, like funny Valentine, funny year Valentine, funniest Valentine. <laughs> uh, Chris Brooks is six foot four. That's still big. <laughs> Alex Shelley is definitive. Five foot ten. Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I just remember that first time, like, Sasha and I watched a Chris Brooks match. We were like, is the girl he's fighting really short, or is he really tall? <laughs> and I think they were both correct. What did you send? Final Atomic Buster? Oh shit, nice! Yeah, I, I, I saw that just as, uh, <laughs> just as that popped up. Uh, the Scorpion Death Drop. <laughs> Sweet ball music! <laughs> Ow. <laughs> God, that's uh... Just keep hugging. <laughs> There's two finger pokes of doom now. <laughs> uh. All right. God, this is uh such an interesting matchup. It's just like <laughs> It's like he's fighting his mentor or something. <laughs> he's fighting his own past. <laughs> I used the doorknob to get in here, you know what I mean? <laughs> when it comes to Bray Wyatt, that's the quote I remember the most. Because he tried his damnedest to come up with something about doorknobs. <laughs> oh, is that the... the... Promo Husky Harris when he was or Husky something. Harris, yeah. Yeah. I forgot what McGillicuddy said during that, actually. Uh, he was gonna take your breath away. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. His, his promo was about breath. <laughs> well, considering he did pretty alright, honestly. <laughs> yeah. Everyone would do better than fucking, um... Oh, God, what was his fucking name? I don't even... The, 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 the hillbilly guy. Oh my god. <laughs> Eli Cottonwood. <laughs> what did he do? He did a promo about mustache. Oh, right, right. <laughs> I mean, I don't have a mustache. <laughs> but like, but I got the mustache. best mustache here. <laughs> Even though I don't have one. Yeah, he was like the first Wyatt family member. <laughs> 
And then everyone was like, actually, Eli Cottonwood kind of sucks. Let's get Luke Harper. <laughs> now he definitely has a mustache. <laughs> Oh uh, god, now I'm just remembering the right gay guy again. I can't concentrate. <laughs> <laughs> Sasha and I were joking the other day about half the brain that you do. <laughs> god, Sid sucked. <laughs> That's the wrestling hill I'll die on, is that Sid was just awful. <laughs> I don't general. know where I... I don't know where I stand on him. <laughs> The only thing he had going for him was that he was big and he had like crazy eyes. <laughs> These uh, promos are enjoyable, I suppose. <laughs> but uh, oh, it's live, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Literally asking in the middle of a promo to start it over. I did. Live, I, did <laughs> I did. Uh, download. You know, the official Fire Pro version of them. Because I was just like, hey, his promo is really cool. And stuff like that. And <laughs> that's all in a match, and I looked over his move list, and I'm like, what? He was this basic? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Broke his goddamn leg doing a second rope jump. <laughs> well, there you go, I suppose. It's funny because uh, GM Spectre's Project Outsider mod, I would always do random rumbles. I swear, like, every time I end up playing this in Vicious. <laughs> <laughs> These men are getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> well, one of them is 66, so... <laughs> <laughs> In this form, maybe? <laughs> also, like, it wasn't until he's fighting Bray Wyatt that I really realized that Waylon Mercy is fucking orange. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Been standing out in the sun a lot. You know? Boiled like a fresh hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking that hot dog water, you know? <laughs> oh no. Okay, I will download He Hate Me, or I'll make him. <laughs> I promise. And there's a He Hate Me for uh, the PC version. <laughs> if we ever get back of the PC version, I'll have to uh, throw, the, throw him in there. Remember hey, he uh... Nah, of course. Nobody wants it. <laughs> Mercy now has the worst win-loss record in the company right now. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Is he Owen, like, 6? Owen, 5. <laughs> That was somehow 100% match. Jeez. Amazed. He's gonna get that first win and we're gonna, like, explode. <laughs> At the top, like when I saw Matt Holmes come out of number 21 in the Royal Rumble. <laughs> <laughs> Fuka in her casual wear for the title match. <laughs> yeah, for a second I was like, wait, who is this? And yet she still got, like, kick pads on. <laughs> I just imagine Fuka always has those on because there's, you know, there's always going to be a possible moment where she has to kick something. <laughs> Fuka wears those knee pads to keep us safe. <laughs> I feel both safe and very unsafe around Fuka. <laughs> yeah. uh, let's see if uh... Chris Saban gets punched in the next Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what the Oh, that was so good. That wouldn't be as big a deal if it were Alex Shelley, because he's used to he's used to time splitting. <laughs> that reminds me of a long time ago when I streamed uh, SmackDown 2. Uh, this is before the uh, I guess the the crew assembled. Uh, <laughs> there was a Doctor Hibbert that I put in there because that one joke with him punching through the uh, the photo frame was going around. 
and I like that SmackDown 2, like, literally had the Paul Phoenix punch in there. <laughs> and I remember during one match, he just did that, and the match instantly ended. <laughs> like, mid-animation, it was just KO. <laughs> oh, we'll fight him on the sides. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I can't, I can't do a Hibbert laugh. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit closer. <laughs> Here, have a lollipop. <laughs> I'm just All watching this talk. last match and like <laughs> stressing. <laughs> oh no! Don't let her punch you. <laughs> oh no, she's doing it. <laughs> about the Simpsons song guy. Yeah. Uh, without the Simpsons song, I won't mention that uh, Virtual Springfield might be on the list for next week. Maybe. Yeah, which is a game that I have very, uh, very old memories of. It's kind of weird that it's one of those games where it's like they actually paid attention to all the fake games within the show, and they made them like real mini games. Which, uh, <laughs> it's something that every show game adaptation should be doing. <laughs> so I was thinking, like, regarding Aqua Team, like, there's no good Aqua Team game, and I was thinking, like, with all the freight games they have in there, you could just make, like, a WarioWare game or something. Did he fool the audience <laughs> Sorry about that, <laughs> Oh, I just got the shit punched out of me. Who <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that is? That, that question. <laughs> yeah. Now that's what we call foreshadowing. <laughs> Add that to the TV tropes page. Yeah. <laughs> 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 When they make the Melstream TV tropes page, Whale and Mercy will be under the butt monkey trope belt. <laughs> Whoa, what? <laughs> what the f? <laughs> 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 what the f? This is gonna be a clip worthy match right here. <laughs> what the heck? Uh, that, uh, one of the moves I have downloaded. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> I got the Z axis isn't like totally right, so he's just like floating for a bit. <laughs> yeah, his shadow is just like way like down in the. Punch the shadow out of him. <laughs> Punch his soul out. <laughs> Why is Spooka doing Virtua Fighter moves? Well, do you have evidence that she's not a Virtua Fighter character? Uh, also in terms of, uh, wacky custom moves, for some reason that move reminded me that I have a twist on the, uh, testicular claw, where oh, the, no. uh, the opponent midway through powers up and then just does an <laughs> arm twist that makes them fly. <laughs> like that. Oh, wait, is that, are you, are you saying that there's, it's the, it's the dick flip move? I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like the the man who will not be named Dick Flip move. Or yeah, it might. Be. A better Dick Flip, yeah. <laughs> like it, the way it's animated is very like anime in a way. <laughs> like, <laughs> bomb. <laughs> <laughs> After all those moves, he's a bit busy. <laughs> Rope break, come on. <laughs> I have the workshop <laughs> open on the side here, and it's funny how, like, people have made, like, Xavier Woods' OC from WrestleMania 2000 in here. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>
Oh yeah, that one was great too. I misread that as Enja from Samurai Showdown. Now I want to make the exploding pants move. Oh god, you could. Yeah. You totally could. <laughs> I mean, there wouldn't be an explosion, uh. but... <laughs> it could just be like a matte thud or something. I mean, there's that Q setting that Mo found out about. <laughs> yeah, where he just made, like, Scotty Duati's worm, like, shake the earth. <laughs> no, I said it. Yeah, well, I, I don't know if you were here for the Samurai Showdown. Uh, oh my god, the Quan Chi fatality. I was thinking about that, too. <laughs> That'd be a great submission. <laughs> if they don't tap out, he just awkwardly really taps <laughs> Jesus Christ! Chris Saban <laughs> will not stay down. <laughs> Chris is like the only one that has like stood a chance against He's this woman. Fighting for God and Chuck E. Cheese's. <laughs> the death of Chuck E. Cheese's <laughs> has made him angry. <laughs> <laughs> Fallen, Chris. <laughs> Yeah, the Moomcraft, I feel, is just gonna add, like, another layer to this whole thing. <laughs> like, if Chris Saban wins here, I'll be a bit sad, but also I'll understand. <laughs> well... God, it's like there's an actual match against this lady instead of her just murdering people. <laughs> Watch is gonna end in like a critical and Chris will be in the hospital for five months. <laughs> I'm sweating. God, he's just he's just brain busting the shit out of her. <laughs> how am I more how am I worried for her all of a sudden? <laughs> this is weird. Yeah. through everything that she can possibly do, and now at this point, Chris is realizing it. <laughs> <laughs> He's like that one opponent that's like, wait a minute. <laughs> Hold on here. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe the uh, the front kick uh, is different. Just got right the fuck back up. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Dude, Chris Saban, no Jesus ever. Christ. Wow. That... You know he, what? That, he that is, he uh, deserves it, and now Fuka is like what? Four, four and one. one. <laughs> that match is incredible! Holy crap! Oh yeah, I think Sasha actually talked about the grenade uh, last night. Oh, don't worry, Fuka. You're gonna be in the fucking title tournament, the the world heavyweight title tournament. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My God! Out of all the matchups. <laughs> oh right, they're still the, the main event. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like they just they just like put the mic back on. They're like, oh, sorry, that was the main event. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Later. <laughs> After a one-hour curtain jerker and that. <laughs> <laughs> Congrats, we have made the any version of WrestleMania. <laughs> <laughs> Emmy Mania 2000. <laughs> God. <laughs> Most of my Twitter feed is now just going to be Fire Pro content. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. <laughs> Okay, Emmy Mania space. will happen. I I'm gonna <laughs> ensure it somehow. <laughs> I guarantee it. Also, this match is not going to top that previous one unless Matt Helms literally gains a Green Lantern ring. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he might Whoa! at this point. That's <laughs> an animation I've never seen before. <laughs> well, it certainly started pretty amazing. <laughs> Like that drop kick over the top rope animation. That's like new, I think. 
I've seen that a couple of times, but it's great every single time it happens. <laughs> I know it's probably impossible because you can't really edit counters, but I would love somebody to do Movecraft and make the fucking Shawn Michaels overselling from like SummerSlam 05. Where you just, <laughs> you just oh. like, you just have them like do a certain move and then just have them like <laughs> bounce up in the air like you did. <laughs> Cartwheel over the top rope and take an entire <laughs> lap around the ring. <laughs> I mean, we actually did see someone make the, uh, the oversold Stone Cold Stunner, so... <laughs> <laughs> Do they make the I... Yeti Bear Hug yet? <laughs> Not yet that we have seen. <laughs> I'm gonna make the most accurate Reese of all time, because nobody else is going to. Complete with, uh... When he was in that Vince Russo Christian show and he was doing like Dusty Rhodes elbows on people. This <laughs> is uh, certainly an image that will be with me for the rest of my life. That Ring of Glory. Yeah. <laughs> he was like, it looked like he was the absolute best part because he was just the personification of evil and he was just doing like goofy shit the entire time. I feel like, like James Mitchell was in there as Satan also. Oh yeah! James Mitchell's fucking great. Like, he was, like... He was good in ECW. He was good in TNA. It went downhill when they stopped letting Abyss be managed by him. The only <laughs> bad thing about James Mitchell was he was involved with Relic. Ah. <laughs> which is killer spelled backwards. Oh, <laughs> see, <laughs> hearing it, I didn't really make the connection, but... So, Next the joke stage. about that is, they make sure to tell you every single episode of TNA Impact that Relic is killer spelled backwards. Ah, so, uh, Nilbog from Trolls, then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I killed the <laughs> Sorry, I mean, uh, the goblins! <laughs> you can't piss on hospitality. I won't allow it! <laughs> God, that old scene. I like how that scene was decided by the director looking at it. It's like, no, this is too, it's too boring. Uh, go to the bathroom on the food. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I don't know, just do it. <laughs> she calls that the rear view. It's boss time. <laughs> it's Shin. He's a rock star. <laughs> so uh, up Hurricane, skull. what are you doing? Oh, okay. Is Hurricane bleeding? Oh, yeah, he is. Yeah, he is. Oof. <laughs> uh, They're definitely uh, okay. pulling out all the stops to try to, like, beat the previous match. <laughs> I feel like it's just like, dr uh, like uh, intensity fatigue. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> He's like, so you can were you not watching the previous match? I'm pretty sure that's what Puka was doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did just see that in the uh, workshop there. Uh, it's pretty good. I want to, um, make that Street Fighter EX throw uh, that Dr. Dark had, the one that got censored about like five times. Uh-oh. Burner Breaker. Oh, Burner Breaker! Boom! I apologize to your neck. <laughs> because that throw was like, Ooh. it was originally him... Ugh. It was originally him sneaking behind them and... Perfect! Wait. <laughs> 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 It was originally uh, him slitting their throat with a blade, which then got censored into a generic throw. Then it got censored into him blowing dynamite in their face. And now it's censored into him using, like, an electronic knife or something? Turkey cutter. Yeah. Street Fighter EX is weird. 
<laughs> but that's what makes it great. And Prada Morgan wins. <laughs> and he's, uh... <laughs> I like how he was trying to do heal stuff, but he's too tired. <laughs> Hurricane is, like, lying in a pool of his own blood. Prada Morgan <laughs> now has the best win-loss record in the company. Really? He is 5-0. and oh. oh, wow. Jeez. So he's undefeated. I also, but I don't think he's a junior heavyweight either, so, uh, tournament. Well, he's currently one of the champions, so... Oh, yeah. Should the tag team champions be allowed in the tournament? Hmm. Not not the junior heavyweight champion. Sabin, Sabin can take the month off, but... All right. 95.4%. 732 over capacity. Not bad. Not bad yeah. Here in America, Urban. Jay Uso and Becky Lynch won the junior heavyweight tag team titles. Yay! DDP. DDP. Hopefully not with a flu. Keno, Paul, Ken and Battle. Oh, not Ral. Okay, I just forgot. Wait, no, is it Ramon it's a, and Dan? A, no, a Noah wrestler named Keno, who's like the coolest ah. guy in the world. <laughs> Wait, Axel and Miss? Kevin of TV. <laughs> you know me from TV, it's Kevin. <laughs> yeah, oh. the, the decapitation. We actually made money for once. Yeah. <laughs> The, the the decapitations with Movecraft are gonna be uh all over the place. Gonna be plentiful. Yeah. Nothing Not noteworthy, noteworthy happened this month except for that fucking Fuka Saban match. Seriously. <laughs> oh, it is a fist of the North Star reference, definitely. Yeah. I mean, it exists. It's going to be a fist of the North Star reference. Is what I've learned through rest of my life. <laughs> Keno's, Keno's theme is great because it's by a band called Garlic Boys. <laughs> uh, my favorite minion of Rowl's. Star Wrestler... I guess we'll figure out who that is. Yamazaki, maybe? Wesker. <laughs> <laughs> I have no use for this wrestling anymore. <laughs> Matt Bloom left Capcom. Tensai. <laughs> Alright. Sometimes I forget that we actually do have a Japanese Wesker uh, voice actor for uh, Marvel 3, I believe. And the problem was he sounded way too cool to be Wesker. <laughs> <laughs> uh... I think uh, that ended up being the voice of Enrico Pucci, so... <laughs> Oh, um, Joji Nakata? Yeah. Oh, he's everywhere. He's the best. He was Kazuya so... in Tekken 1. Huh. <laughs> so... Uh, so, yeah, it was Wesker. Uh... Wesker. And, yeah, Yamazaki. Yeah, I, I recognize the character for Yama now. <laughs> but, God, like... With voice actors and stuff, I actually started, like, this fucking thumb parody movies from the early 2000s. I've been fascinated with them because their Japanese dub casts are full of, like, really high-ranking people for some reason. Wow, we sold out of all of our towels and goods in one month. <laughs> and we have 16 Man, the shirts left. <laughs> The Fuga shirts are gonna probably go in the trash afterwards <laughs> from uh, certain fans. Well, hold on. Yes! Okay, I'll get it later. Yes! Okay. Okay. Sorry. No worries. Well, we're almost, yeah. we're, we're basically done anyway. It's 12.06. Yeah. So, uh, let me check something really quick. No, 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 no. Uh, look, event tournament. We can. Oh, shit. 
we we'll can't say book that for next week. Yep. Or cool. next time. Cool. So, yeah. um, I guess that's it for this week. Did uh, yeah, a lot of fucking great matches. Fuka like is slowly becoming our figurehead, even if she lost that match, because she's just yeah. been like. I love that you put her in because, like, she was in a visual novel, but she turned out to be, a, like, a, a fucking killer. Yeah. <laughs> Spike shots off knows how to pick him. <laughs> so... Also, we're going to be... We're going to be, uh, plugs. Um, I might just put them in the Twitter description because there's a whole bunch of links I just found, so... Good idea. Yeah. Uh, but in general, just, you know, donate to places that need it. Support people that are out there protesting. Um, but yeah, I think... I think that does it for this week. Or not this week, for tonight. Because we will be back tomorrow with more Soccer Wars. Yeah, Soccer Emmy Wars. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> uh... Thanks, everyone, for watching. Uh, thanks, Keith, for showing up. It's been really nice to have you. It's been a pleasure to be here. Thank you for the invite. Yeah. Now you're contractually obligated to show up every time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you, Sasha and Melly, for joining me for this, too. No problem. No problem. All right. And so have a good night, everybody. See you tomorrow. See you then. See ya. Have a good night.